it's Katie, and I have a random thought. So I'm really excited for the Golden Globes this Sunday. There were a lot of great movies that came out this year, as well as a lot of great TV. Unfortunately, Game of Thrones isn't nominated for the TV categories, and I'm wearing my Game of Thrones shirt in protest. I don't really know how it's a protest, but I'm just mad that Game of Thrones didn't get, like, anything. I think maybe they were nominated for, like, some sort of B-list award, but still, I mean, come on. Game of Thrones totally should have been nominated. But I'm going to tell you who I think should win in all of the categories. They probably won't all win because, I don't know, my taste is different than the Academy's. But here are my picks for the 2013 Golden Globes. Best Motion Picture Drama. My pick is Argo. I really enjoyed Argo. I thought it was great. Um, that would probably be my pick, but I don't think that one's going to win. I think it's going to go to Lincoln. But um, yeah, I'm, I'm rooting for Argo. Best Actress in a Motion Picture Drama. Definitely have to go with Helen Mirren because everything she touches is gold. She's just a great actress and I think she'll probably take this one, but I have no clue who that's going to go to. That's a tough category. <laughs> Best Actor in a Motion Picture Drama. My pick is Dan Daniel Day-Lewis in Lincoln. I thought he was fantastic in that movie and uh, he'll probably take this one. Best motion picture, comedy or musical? Pause for a second. I hate it that they put comedy and musical in the same category. It doesn't make any sense because Les Mis is in this category and Les Mis is a drama. I think musicals shouldn't count. They should either be a drama or a comedy. I don't think that it needs to be comedy or musical. But obviously my choice is going to be Les Mis because I loved it and I hope it wins even though I don't think it will because a lot of people had problems with it. But I think Silver Linings Playbook is going to take this category even though I'm really rooting for Les Mis. Best Actress in a Comedy or Musical. This is a tough category. You have Meryl Streep going up against Maggie Smith and also you got to throw in there Jennifer Lawrence. It's kind of crazy because I love all three of those people. I'm probably going to go to Maggie Smith or Meryl Streep, but I'm going to be rooting for Jennifer Lawrence. She was nominated for Winter's Bone and didn't win, so I'm kind of hoping that she can win the Golden Globe for Silver Linings Playbook. Best Actor in a Comedy or Musical. Obviously Hugh Jackman. I loved Hugh Jackman in Les Mis. He was fantastic. I definitely think Hugh Jackman should win. If he doesn't, that's, it's really a shame. Best Animated Feature Film. This is a fun category, because Pixar usually always takes it. And of course, I'm going to go with Pixar. I'm definitely going to go with Brave. Even though Brave wasn't my favorite Pixar movie, it was absolutely beautiful. So I think Brave is definitely going to take it. But it could be a close race between that, maybe Wreck-It Ralph. Now on to TV. Best Drama Series. Alright, so if you don't already know, I'm kind of obsessed with Downton Abbey. Laugh all you want, but if you haven't seen it, you got to give it a chance because Downton Abbey is like the best show. It really is. It's amazing. And I love that time period and all the acting is just amazing. So. Any TV category that has Downton Abbey in it, I'm going to vote for. <laughs> so best television drama, my vote, Downton Abbey. Although Homeland will probably take it again. <laughs> best actress in a drama series, I'm going to go with Michelle Dockery from Downton Abbey, of course. Best actor in a TV drama, I'm thinking Jeff Daniels from The Newsroom. He's really, really good. Either that or Steve Buscemi from Boardwalk Empire. Both are fantastic actors. I don't really have a preference. Best television series, comedy or musical. I'm gonna go with Modern Family. I love Modern Family. That show's so funny, so I'm gonna go with Modern Family. Best actress in a TV series comedy, Julia Louise Dreyfus from Veep. If you haven't seen that show, it's hilarious and she's so funny. Best actor in a TV series, comedy or musical, Louis C.K. is probably going to win this, I think. Now for a little bit of a rant. Why is Walking Dead not nominated? for a Golden Globe. It's bad enough that Game of Thrones isn't nominated. Why isn't Walking Dead nominated? That show's awesome. It has some good acting. The special effects are just amazing. And the directing is really great. Why isn't it nominated? Beats me. I feel like it's really hard to get sci-fi, medieval, fantasy things into the award shows. I don't really know why, but I feel like they always get snubbed every year. A show like Game of Thrones is huge. It's absolutely gigantic. There's so many people that work on it, and there's so many different departments, and it's probably one of the most expensive shows on television, and it, it delivers every episode. Like, it's amazing. I, it should be nominated. I don't know. Maybe I'm biased. Maybe I'm biased. It should be nominated. What do you guys think of the Golden Globe nominees? Let me know who you think is going to win in the comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Hey, thanks for watching my video. You can find me on Twitter and Facebook and you can also check out my previous video over here. And always don't forget to like and subscribe.